Here we are going to show you exactly how the hello sign integration currently works. Of course, this integration can be used with any of the transaction documents like quotes, contracts, or invoices. However, here we are showing how it works inside of the customer order record type. The first thing we're going to do is to pull up the customer order that we're going to send out using our workbook script with the hello sign integration. This will pull the PDF from workbooks and send it via hello sign for digital signing. So I'm going to go ahead and fill, uh, open up the customer order here. And if we scroll down um, to the bottom of the page, they're going to see that there's several fields for the contract signature name, the contract signature email, and the contract signature status. You can make the email field fill in dynamically if you wanted to use a dynamically linked item for the signature name. And you could also have more than one signer if you wanted to have those additional fields present. For this demonstration, we didn't add those in. But in the script that we've written, uh, we just commented that out. So it's very easy to add that in when you need to. So now all I have to do to um, send this via DocuSign is go to Run Process and click on the Send to Hello Sign button there. Um, this is going to run the script. And then what's going to happen after the script sends it over to Hello Sign is that um, there's going to be a pop-up window indicating the status. So in this case, it says here the Send to Hello Sign process completed successfully. Uh, HS response. I'm going to hit OK. And then I'm going to go over to my inbox because Hello Sign will have sent uh, that over into my inbox. And I'll be able to see that for signing. So I'm just going to close out of this record here. And I'm going to go into my inbox. And this is uh, obviously this would be the uh, inbox of the sender that you're sending it to. So I'm going to go ahead and click review and sign here. And that's going to bring me over to the um, hello sign contract. Now, before I go ahead and sign this, I'm going to show you a dashboard that we've actually created um, inside of workbooks for customer orders. So we're actually going to see here, and we've got our um, order 21. And the contract signature is a waiting signature. So basically, uh, what happened is that uh, our script will actually pull back the status from hello sign and into workbook. So you can you know kind of see see where that is. Um, and then when I go back over to uh, my hello sign here, I'm going to go ahead and sign it. So I click this little got it button there. And now I can see that this is the actual contract that got pulled and dynamically generated from inside of uh, inside of workbooks here. So everything is in there. And I just scroll down to the bottom here as you know the end user. And I'm going to go ahead and sign the signature page here. I click to sign. And then um, I insert my signature. So I've used Bozo here. And I can actually. Um, Go ahead, and uh, you'll see there's a little I agree button down here. I'm going to click that. That's what how it works in Hello Sign. So you go ahead and sign that. And once the document is signed, I'm going to go back into Workbooks, and I'm just going to actually type in um, the order. So that was that D order 21. Um, I'm going to type it in here. That's going to pull that record actually up. And we're going to see here that we've got signed 2014 12 18. So December 18th. It was signed at this time. There's a timestamp. If I go back into the customer orders, um, contracts awaiting response, there's now nothing in there anymore. So uh, basically, uh, that's pretty much it as far as how the hello sign integration works. So um, we'd love to uh, hear your feedback. Thank you.